Hey, this is Brian with King Grizzly with a quick tip for renaming a bunch of files at once. I have to do this all the time, especially with images, but sometimes with other types of uh, files like documents. Uh, so I thought people might find this tool interesting. Of course, AI can be helpful in this regard too. I happen to be on a, a Mac, Apple computer. Um, I got this program called Name Changer and it has saved me a massive amount of time. So here's a bunch of JPEGs I have that I wanted to rename for a tutorial. Let me just show you some of what you can do here with this program. Um, and I'm sure there's others like it, but I would highly recommend getting something like this. So there's all these options for what we can do uh, with the file names. We can remove characters, we can append information, we can prepend information. It's pretty interesting. We can create uh, a sequence. So if I select that, then it changes the options I have. So maybe I wanted to name this for some reason. Let's say this was like, this is a tutorial. So I'm going to put in a tut the word tutorial and a hyphen and look, it's actually uh, starting to show what my rename files would be. And I can say like, well, how many digits do I want this to use? Uh, I can even choose like what digit to start with, but do I want to replace the file name, append the information, prepend the information? You see, it's quite powerful. Um, so what I was going to do, I think I'm just going to rename mine, period. But you can see, you can even change the case, like to make sure everything is lowercase. I think these already were. Uh, it's it's really nice. I usually end up using replace all occurrences with. So typically I'm trying to uh, get rid of something like maybe these are Pexels images that I, I don't want to leave the Pexels name. So let's say I got rid of Pexels. So I could say get rid of that. And then over here, I don't put anything. And then I just hit rename. And then it's already uh, renamed those. What I'm actually going to try to do to, to these is just rename a, a kind of a generic number sequence because this is just for a tutorial. So you've probably already seen what you needed to know here. But if you want to watch me try to figure out how to do this just for fun, uh, stick around. I guess what I need to do is just use the sequence one, right? So I want, I actually do want to just put tutorial and then I'm going to go to two digits and uh, I'm going to do replace and I'll keep the JPEG. I think I might need to add that next. So I'm not sure if I know how to keep the JPEG on here. So I'm going to rename them. Are you sure you want to remove the extensions? Sure. And then I'm just going to go and I'm going to append JPEG back on all of those. There's probably some better way to do that. So now I rename them. Oops, look at that. It's, I think my system might have kept that JPEG. I don't know. Did that work? Yeah, it worked over here. I don't know why it says JPEG, JPEG. Anyway, I'm not an expert at this, but this tool does save me a ton of time. Hopefully that was useful to somebody.